back to the hotel. where we're staying at our hotel. That's so neat. I love that you say a prayer. I oh, yes. need a prayer. Yes. Thank you. Setting up for the show. travel to the Philippines and perform at these school assemblies. These children are incredible. These people that we met have so much potential to be leaders. with them and really just spend time getting to know how they develop the values that Believe teaches their schools, such as respect, excellence in all that they do. Thank you so much! We're so grateful! Thank you! It's like Torch Family Music Club. You can find us on Facebook. Torch Family Music, thank you! that I will be able to study. So I went to the river, I gathered some stone and sand so that I can uh, sell them to people who are constructing their houses. Uh, before, when I was in high school, I don't know how to survive. But here I am now. 
I am successful in my own way. Not rich, but rich with people who love me. So that's my uh, story. Story of my life. Any further auditorium? Thanks, you guys. <laughs> Everyone's helping us carry stuff. <laughs> The greatest thing that we face is in our own mind. If we tell ourselves that we can be great leaders, then we will become great leaders. We become whatever we put our mind to. So this song that I wrote, Believe, encompasses what Believe International teaches their students. That was very amazing. And this time, we will be going to hear the most special person who made his way on making this event possible. And finally, we will be able to see him personally and hear him speak in front of us. So ladies and gentlemen, the president of Believe International Foundation, our beloved sponsor, Put your hands together for Mr. Carmen L. Whitey. Para 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 sila. Come here, para 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 sila. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We are so happy to be here. Believe International is a highly effective charity operating in the Philippines designed to help deserving young people lift themselves out of poverty. We give them scholarships through high school and college and additional training that unleashes their inner potential, enabling them to begin solving their own problems. We also give them leadership training so that as professionals in their community, they will help lift others out of poverty. They become leaders for the next generation.
and we're, we're about, about to, to ride a boat. There's a current. We're our hotel's right next to the lake overlooking it. People take the river. Look at our show our hotel, there's Grammy. I'm coming with you. Coconut tree. Coconut tree. Coconut tree. A horn. Mm -hmm. Wow. Horn. Oh, that's awesome. And it's the horn. That's so cool. Yeah. That's so cool. So that He's getting a coconut from the tree. Yeah, for us. He uses this really long pole with a knife on the end and then this other thing. Mm -hmm. Experience. They just cut it down. He opened it up. They brought us out straws. Thank you. Salama. And now we're drinking it from a swift straw. Bye. Bye. Okay. <laughs> Going back to the boat. Okay, they are on their way back to the hotel. Back to their co oh, Steph, coconut Steph adventure. To, uh, Marco Polo. Uh, uh, anyway. <laughs> sacred opportunity of visiting the temple in Manila. We are members of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. This church has temples, and inside temples we perform saving ordinances such as baptism for people who have passed away already and did not have a chance to be baptized while they were alive. 
If you want to watch more of our videos, hit subscribe.